Control up. Your enterprise resource fabric unified in one console. In this video, you will see how to perform an application upgrade on a live terminal server farm. As you can see, in this example, we are experiencing some heavy CPU utilization. The process view, sorted by CPU consumption, shows that the faulty application named businessapp.exe is responsible for this issue. We will simulate an application upgrade using a new version of this application, which was confirmed to resolve the high CPU usage issue. First, we ensure that all of our users are aware of the upgrade by sending them a super message. A super message allows us to gain feedback from the users, for example, to make sure they save their data before terminating the application. Next, we temporarily disallow execution of businessapp.exe on the affected servers. This can be done through the machines view by selecting the servers and choosing the process execution control, disable process execution in the context menu. In the dialog box, we configure a message to appear if a user attempts to launch this application while the upgrade is still in progress. After reviewing our user's feedback, we can now terminate all running instances of the application by using the processes view, searching for business app and invoking the kill process action from the context menu. After verifying that all existing instances of the application are terminated, we perform the upgrade using the copy files action in the machines view. A valid network source path and credentials must be provided for the operation to complete successfully. When the upgrade process is completed, we can unlock the application on the affected servers by selecting Enable Process Execution and providing the application name. Users can now log in and run the new version of the application. The machine's view of ControlUp now displays a normal CPU utilization compared to the previous version. We can also monitor individual instances of the application using the Processes view or display the user sessions using the Sessions view. For more information, please visit our website at www.smart-x.com.